Alrighty, yeah. These clips I'm gonna play, I'm gonna play. Well, yeah, actually, yeah. All these clips I'm gonna play are, I I do have in that five and five hour video I made the collaboration and up. Looks like uh, people were starting to make them stink of uh, awareness of a Pred wearing CPK, so it's good. Spam like has been bitching on for the uh, same people calling, you know, oh, your boy C Ed is CP suspect. Say people like, I guess he's been bitching on saying they were saying that shit for the last two weeks. Good. Because of, that's a serious fucking allegation right there. That's a serious charge. Gomez made a good point. But sometimes, you know, there is an investigation number as well. Because I, and I even, Aaron says, share it out, which I promptly did on my community page. I made it, I showed the is that in my video, five hour long? I'm not even done. I thought I was, I was going to do a two hour video. And it went over five hours or ten minutes. And not, not even done. So we're going to do a part two. Not Now, we'll do it tomorrow. Tomorrow night when I got some time. I don't have much time. But I do have time for this little quickie. It's going to be a, probably ten minutes. Like that. Anyways. So I am. <clears throat> Aaron put on there. He said, Spam love, carve up. There has to be an incident number for the feds and other investigating departments to investigate an incident for a case to be built. And I explained in my video earlier, when Brian and I got busted for records of danger fire, firearm, it took the county three months to build up a case and get a case number to go forward with a case. Because at the time when I, was, I did the weekend of a county, there was no case pending at the time. So I was let go and I got to go home on Monday night. Three hours, three months later, I was summoned to go to court for my case and then resolve it. So, yeah, sometimes case take a while. And in this day and age, after we just gone through COVID, yeah, we just went through, we just went through COVID like that. Ed's case was he was arrested on, on the 22nd of January 2019. COVID hit 2020, and it backed up a lot of things like that. I mean, there are cases out there they're starting to finally get, you know, full worry and to get resolved because COVID backed it up for quite a while. And sometimes it takes time when cases get stalled, like a, a witness or evidence that's pressing to be perceived in the courts, you know, like, you know, like hearings, all this stuff. I mean, it takes a while, especially when you're doing serious nature of the crime. Petty misdemeanors resolve in like days and not weeks. Big ones would take months if not years. So, like I said, and then the case number can be generated. If there's going to be charges to fry for an investigation, my suggestion to Spamla is to suggest to your CP suspect friend, Pride Word, the alleged murder rapist, Debbie Father, CP suspect, is to unlock his phone. And that's another thing I said. I think it's unusual that he didn't ask for the phone. He said it over here. Uh, uh, Alex asked, him, Did you ask your phone back? No. Okay. Anyway, let, let's continue. Lock his phone for investigation so his suspicion and papers and, and you know, incident number can be swatched if there is a CP on your friend's phone. Then you declare. Or if there's illegal content on his phone, then the case number can be defrived and pride work can be charged. Did the plea deal have CP charges on there to be negotiated? Probably not. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. So I shared that post. And I, I tagged Angela's name anywhere. I said, also, sometimes a case... Get stalled or goes cold, like I said, lack of evidence or, uh, you know, witnesses uh, to collaborate as well. Uh, it goes cold for a while. But it does not mean it is closed. Funny how Edward did not want his phone back. Oh, yeah. Why did the warrant not cover his mother's, mother's laptop? People say, his mother's like, yeah, I agree. His mother's is over seven years old. She had nothing to do with the, uh, the, the raid and nothing like that. It was him and his brother. But the fact was... Him and his brother were residing with his mom. They were splitting the rent. And Edward admitted that he used the, his mom's laptop a lot to edit videos for his old channel. For his Edward S. and his Predator News and Drama channel. Then he lost that. Then he lost the 2.0 channel. Yeah. There was incidents like that. Always like that. But now, what, what, is if you ask Edward, people are like, oh, go ask Edward. Go ask Ed. Edward like, I don't have to try shit to you. That's what it, that's what it come down to. Let's get started. Let's play the let's play the couple of videos. I'll play the videos and read the comments and I'll be that. Question and Edward fucking replied to a different thing. He replied because there was five charges, brothers. There was four drug charges of different big ones, and there was a trying to take a gun from an officer. That was his brother's five fucking charges. 
Edward um, did. And people can't think that way because they... Bro, no. Edward said they were looking at five charges. That's what it was. Yeah, it wasn't about his brother looking at five charges. They were told they were looking both looking at five charges for CP. His brother added another charge on, or he tried to grab the gun from the detective, and Predwar picked up another charge for controlled substance of methamphetamine. They were looking at five charges between both of them for CP. They just want to hate. I mean, how, how many images did they accuse him of? I forget what they said. I think they said it was enough for like five charges. I five guess. charges, CP, CP right there. Because I know. God, I forgot, I forgot where. God damn, I really. I, I, they said it'd be enough for like five counts. So five counts, okay. yeah. I mean, I, I, I really, I really forgot where I read this. I know it was recently, though. Oh my God, where was I reading this? You know, I, I don't know what, uh, where I heard it, but I think it's something like if it, a certain amount of them, like one, two, about I don't know, ten or fifteen, then it's uh, then it's one count, one charge of CP. Uh, something about how how many images of CP have. I think it goes up to about. 20 or 30 then then if you if you have 30 is a charge and you have more than that there's another charge add to it god i don't remember i have to i like to maybe i'll might research that see you know how many images does re, you know goes up to per charge you know per you know counts i know it wasn't all mine was it you okay <laughs> Well, no, 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 no. It's 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 not 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 exactly that. I'm just trying to. Where did? Oh my God! Where did you said there was there was a you know a lot of enough for like five counts or something. Five. I'm but yeah, hold on. I'm trying to think where. I, I heard, dude. Was it? Oh my god, dude! I, I really forgot where I read this recently, but I believe if it's over thirty images, it triggers a human review, and if it's and if it's, I mean, it's between one and thirty. It's either. It's yeah, I think it's something like it's, if it's under know. thirty, you, you know, if it's over that, then it's another count, like I don't know. like two counts or three counts. It, you know. Basically, tr triggering the triggering the nick nick. Like if it's between one and third, oh, dude, I really just don't, dude, I, I really just don't know where. I know as recently I read this, uh, maybe. Oh my god! Yeah, dude, I'm going like fucking blank here or maybe it's for the Vegas guy or something I don't fucking know but um yeah I don't know I'm, I'm blank here but yeah I, I mean did they say the tip was sent for, did he, I mean did he tell you I mean did he say the tip was sent from a human being or what I believe it was an anonymous tip sent it to uh, the uh is that what he, yeah, that's what he told you? That's what he said, yeah. Anonymous tip. Well, when it, Edward I mean, was talking to Alex, can you imagine how nervous the person would be? Like, Alex is going to talk to you about this. I'm sure Edward got all tripped up. And oh, he yeah. was oh, not answering okay. questions like okay. the, the real yeah. facts are. I think he was completely well, nervous. Nobody's going to believe me on that, and I understand that, because people want to just believe that, well, Edward said well, Yeah, okay. Okay, let's read some comments here. So, yeah, Becky says, He answered wrong. He was scared. None of this matters. Tripped up? Angela said so. And that one said, Oh, if anyone threatened to rape my kids, I will kill him. Quote from a CP suspect who abandoned his family for a meth habit and menopause pred protectors. Here's the most common explanation we get from that side about it. We don't owe you anything. Anyone can call in a tip. If I explain it, you guys will twist it. Go look it up yourself. Show me a case number. 
Not once has Ed gone on a panel and straight up talk about it. Not once. He lets others talk for him. Yeah, okay. Oh, best comment right here from the dude. An incident number still initiates a case and or an investigation. If they're charges from there, then there would be a case number. Maybe if Ed would unlock his phone for detectives to go through his phone so there isn't a case number. Because an innocent person would just unlock their phone, right, and then go get it back. I don't know, my parents' house hasn't and ever been raided for that. Exactly. Because he's a CP suspect. Okay. Yeah, a LARP, he said, Ed only chews Copenhagen's Another drone racer says, Angela G, please, can you explain in detail how you can tell a good CP suspect from a bad CP suspect? Or do all CP suspects get your respect? One right here. Angela is so unintelligent, ignorant. It's pretty fucking embarrassing to watch. Like second hand cringe. Damn, Fred Protectors, Angela. Junior and Krusty. Triggering Angela. What a wreck group of trash around Ed. The guy who, who got his mom's house raided for CP. Okay, here's another one. Um, one called Locksmith's Free Speech Pounds in Jeopardy. That's for another time. This is the best one right here. Yeah, it's no catching community, Eric. That's what I've been saying. People that attack victims like a catcher, FM, fucking totally uh, mentally fucking abused Christy with everything you said to her, and that's a catcher. Fucking uh, Alex putting out public fucking private fucking phone calls he has with someone. I know y'all like uh, Alex. Fuck Alex. He's a disgusting piece of shit in my mind. I'm not in the catching community, so y'all can take that and run with it, because I said it. <laughs> That's the last chance you get. So, I don't care what anybody thinks about that shit. I don't. Well, that's just exactly it. Like I said earlier, that's what Angela's trying to do. She's trying to throw all these good catchers under the bus to protect her precious print work. That's what it is. That's her motive. Okay, a couple more cons are out of here because my phone's down to 15%. There's certainly is a catching community angela you're just not in it you're in the cp suspect defending bizarro community have fun <laughs> denise macow try to throw her two cents actually angela will be the catching community when they start going out to the traffic or support numbers if you know what i mean okay oh angela said my opinion how about clip whatever i said about him but you won't shut up you giant red beast yeah Crazy how you stick up for Ed, but aren't afraid to go after, after an actual catcher. One that gets conviction. Your moves actually worry me. Alice is great. He's really getting gets these guys to confess everything. Angela G should mind her own P's and Q's. Ben, uh, panel channel back at it, and Angela G brought him out of retirement. Hopefully, Alex catches win at Ed's right hand girl. Say some choice words and talk to her, to her about it. <laughs> Imagine being this upset over ha having to relentlessly vouch for an in real life CP suspect. Bro, does he even put in half the effort to defend himself? Just lets these old dusty broads do it for him. <laughs> Angela just mad. She looks like Haggard. There's a hero. It's a good thing she's not in our community having shit on every catcher and team, yeah. Nanya says, we are in the catch community, y'all, not angels. You put out my private info, leave our heroes alone. Hashtag we said, Alex. Relentlessly sticks up for a CP suspect. Also hates a highly esteemed catcher in community. Okay. We see you, Angela G. And your CP suspect body, too. Oh, her boyfriend can't talk about his CP allegation. Angela has to say it. Sad, really sad, yeah. Yeah, no, she always says, oh, I don't get into drama. I'm always chill. Yeah, well, she's inserting herself in drama just to go back. And she's, 
She's literally trying to go to bat hard for her oppression buddy, a CP suspect, married a rapist, and scumbag father. Yeah. All right, I'm out of here, my job. Peace out.